Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, on a cool, what is it, Wednesday? Wednesday morning. This is Rusty78609, alive and in Technicolor, Cinemascope, and Dolby Sound, which is all alive. Got a smartphone, a Pixel 4a. That's what I do my my uh, videos on. My Yeah, most of my videos are done on the Pixel 4a. But anyway, good morning. Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow. It is right now. And right now it just went choo. So if there's anything you want to be doing, you better get up and get at it because it ain't going to get done unless you do. So with that in mind, it is a cool morning or cold morning here in uh, near Carrizozo, New Mexico. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Carrizozo, New Mexico? <clears throat> the current temperature in Carrizozo is 37 degrees. Uh, yeah, with well, no wind though, but it also show, it, on temperature gauge here it shows outside be 33 degrees, which is uh, cold to me. And the high today is supposed to be 64, which is muy bueno. And with that in mind, moving right along, been living in an RV. This is a Class C motorhome for those of you that don't know me. And uh, hey Google, make us laugh. What do you call a gigantic pile of kittens? A mountain. You want to write that down? <laughs> anyway, uh, what else? Uh, oh, the uh, positive energy button. Somebody sent me this, a viewer subscriber type. It says positive energy, 101 pre recorded motivation boosters. These are booster things. Don't allow anxious thoughts to steal your joy. Accept the good that is flowing into your life. Okay, roger that. Uh, a 10 foe, or 410. Anyway, what else can I tell you? Uh, t t uh, I didn't post the track man video yesterday because it was windy, windy, windy. And the one I did, the it was really crap. Uh, or the one track man did was really crap. It was, uh, no, it was just too windy in the mic. So I'm going to delete that and we'll do another one today. And, and, and I'm going to put that green slime in the tires this morning before I go and then uh, what else yeah I've got it all I've got the front basket on the trike I mean it's ready to go it's a Liberty electric trike uh, yeah from electric uh, yeah just go to liberty trikes.com or something like that or you, you'll find just type in Liberty electric trikes do a search for that and you'll see it yeah it's a neat little three-wheel trike really neat weighs about 60 pounds folds in half yeah and it's real easy to take the handlebars and the seat off for storage so be that as it may moving right along to what uh kcb hello kcb thanks for the video wind noise makes just makes it real that was on home base windy and dusty yeah it is all that glitters isn't gold guys i guarantee you no matter place no matter where you go there's always going to be a downside and you may or may not uh like it you may not like it enough to get rid of it but yeah, I don't think I've ever been anywhere in life where there wasn't something that was a downside. Yeah, there's always that one thing. But anyway, <clears throat> Paul says no hail anyway. Well, not yet. Probably in the spring we'll probably get some, but that's all right. There's, there's no way to get away from it, I don't think. Leslie Feigley on the train. My mistake. Burlington Northern Santa Fe BNSF owned by Berkshire Hathaway, not Union Pacific. I think Union Pacific's a standalone company. Whoever owns it looks like they are making money. Might be good stock to invest in. I don't know, Leslie. Uh, Ralph P. Nothing is ever perfect, especially the weather. Congratulations on the new trike. The old stinking goat and I are happy for you, Rusty. Well, good for you. And here comes the stinking goat to give you a screaming good morning kiss. Alien goat, stinking goat. Screaming Goat. Al Fur, thumbs up to you. Debbie M. The Upside Down Car says, Me parking my car after working all night looks normal. <laughs> Very funny, Debbie M. No, that was a weird deal, man. I still don't know what happened there. I don't know. They, you know, they do a lot of movies out here, you know, and, uh, and they shoot a lot of scenes around the Carrizozo. And so that could have just been a, uh, a movie scene. I don't know. The police did show up. I don't know. It's weird. This person's name is Paladin Justice. Yeah, I remember Paladin. An SUV was turned over as it was hit 
Oh, here we go. An SUV, that's not an SUV, was turned over as it was hit at low speed turning into the Sonic. It doesn't take much if the angle of the collision and the curb is there to assist the turnover. I don't know. I don't know. You could be right. Thank you. Carl H. Hi, Rusty. Uh, I didn't disappear. I'm trying to catch up with your videos. So glad you're happy. Well, I hope you're happy too, Carl H. This person's name is, wow, Zals One Letab. The only thing I don't care for is stove by bed. That's on the Sunlight Travel Trailer. Okay, then get, we get another one. IG, that's the person's name. Uh, home Base 4, I am from the Netherlands, and I love the seasons and the weather changes. If the weather would be the same every day, it would be boring to me, and it would be the same for everybody. Well, you, there are places in the world where it pretty much stays the same, uh, or within a range of, say, 10 degrees, and uh, rains every day at the same time. Well, most of the Hawaiian islands, uh, yeah, you can set your clock in the afternoons by the afternoon rain if you're on the windy or the rainy side. Dare Trixa, as windy as as windy as daily by the North Sea. So apparently, it, it wind it's windy all the time there. Thank you, Dare Trixa, from the North Sea of Germany. This is Gerald McCarty on the upside down car. Hey, Rusty, I hear parts of Arizona got snow today. <laughs> Could be, I don't know. I mean, it, it sure is a cold front here. But the, th the, the one of the things that's different here at, than from where I lived in Texas or have lived in Texas is the cold weather, the cold winds come from the north, northeast. Here, the cold wind today or this cold wet weather came from the west. The wind was from the west last night. So that's interesting. Uh, anyway. It says, Elbert1940 says, Rusty, the video looks to me like the dust is in the distance and your area has just wind. <clears throat> Are you having the dust, dirt in the air? Sure. Yeah, yeah. You know, any, when you're looking in the dist, if you were looking in the dist from a distance at my place, you'd see that it was dusty here. It's just that it takes distance to give the, uh, the dust, uh, uh, make it viewable, I guess. None you biz. You better get ready, Rusty. Record cold coming where you are, not for the next 10 days it's not, <clears throat> or at least that's what the weather forecast sh shows, and maybe something else. Well, I'm not, I w I'll be leaving here uh, the end of this month, two weeks from today, actually, uh, yeah, just about exactly, and uh, going to Texas, so we'll see. Yeah, if, you know, I, I can't do anything about the weather, you know, I, 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 you know, I can't change what the weather's going to be here, but I can change where I am. I don't have to be here, <laughs> you know, king for a day. <clears throat> On the home base, it says, dust in the wind, we are all dust in the wind. Yeah, there's a song about that. Nothing is forever but the earth and the sky. All your money won't buy, all your money won't another minute buy. Or is that only true in Kansas? I don't know, Toto. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Big Mac D, uh, Rusty, do those Liberty Tripes hold someone who weighs 400 pounds? Need something to get me around because of my fast food needs. Uh, I don't know. You'd have to call Liberty Electric Trikes. I don't think so. <clears throat> uh, Philly Bum. Hey, Rusty, do you know any free camping sites in Texas in the Hill Country looking for a place to hang out, eat, and nap? Thanks. No, I sure don't. Not in the Texas Hill Country. I don't think there's any. Well, you go to Walmart. That's about it. All I know of. Uh, hey, Philly Bum, go to uh, lib oh, scratch that <clears throat> freecamping.net <clears throat> and key in, the <clears throat> key in the name of a nearby town where you want to be and see what they come up with. Freecamping.net. Boondocking with Dennis, good morning. Good evening, sir. I'm running the playlist overnight. Stay safe and enjoy life. You too, Dennis. Thank you for your comments. And uh, check out Dennis's channel on YouTube, Boondocking with Dennis. He lives in a pickup truck with a camper. WTBM123, cool. I'm E88 first. I hope she's okay. Oh, first, this is on the upside down car. I hope she's okay. Takes a few days to feel the pain. Second, you got to have a great driving skill to flip a car like that. Just saying, stay safe, everybody. Yeah, it was pretty, I mean, I, I don't know, I never saw anybody get out of that car that, that was flipped. I just saw a lady standing there on the street, and then I found out later she's the uh, uh, owner of the pickup that got run into. I don't know. 
This is home base number four. RV living with a geezer. Check that channel out. Real windy here in Alpine today also. My trailer really rocking. Yeah, well, it, it was real windy. You couldn't have got, if you were in New Mexico, you couldn't have got away from it, I don't think. Uh, Scotty Thompson, cool video talk. Cool video talk. Thank you, Scotty Thompson, the mass bowler from Wisconsin. This person's name is Rip Snorton on the home base. Yesterday it snowed in Yerington, Nevada, also in the High Sierra. So old man winter is coming south. Ethel Perry says, good job, Rusty. Thanks for reporting truth. Well, the reason I'm doing that is I know there's, I've had emails from people that are interested in buying places here, and I just want them to know what the hell they're getting into. You know, I don't, you know this is not, it's nice. I'd say that probably 90% uh, of the days are going to be okay and very nice, or pretty nice, and there's going to be some bad ones. It's true anywhere. Uh, yeah, thank you, Ethel. And this is Lulu59. Hello, Lulu59 says, yes, I was on the phone with my daughter this morning. Well, that's I'm glad you told us that, Lulu. We we were all wondering. I mean, traveling from Alamo Garda to Ruidosa, where she works, she had mentioned that a lot of state troopers are out, maybe because of the high winds today. She called me on her way home this evening. Inside the winds, uh, the winds pretty much subsided back. Yeah, well, it, 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 in the evening, they all, they all dropped down. That's true. Thank you, Lulu. Annette F. Hello, Annette. You might need to get you some tie-down straps for the RV. Well, there are some here that they had the uh, uh, modular home tied down with, but I'm not going to do that. No, it, if it gets that bad, I just won't be here. <clears throat> I hope. On the upside-down car, H-Hog1 says, Watch this. A crazy driver in Carrizozo? Probably another tourist. Yeah, could be. I don't know. I was told it was somebody. Well, I'm not going to say. Because I don't know. It's not. I don't know it. It's repeating a rumor, and that's not a fact. Uh, Mark Reynolds, home base number four. That just adds to the variety of the grandeur of the area. Interesting weather. That's right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, a little, little, little variety. Uh, MJ Car 61, or MG Car 61, Camaro. Some kind of excitement's on the upside down car. Some kind of excitement seems to be in most of your video posts, even without trying, LOL. Well, yeah, it just takes what's, what they give me. Uh, Benny Hill, you want to know what's perfect? My brand new Bissell Crosswave Max. Hey, Google, what is a Bissell Crosswave Max? Here is some information about Bissell Crosswave Cordless Max. The Bissell Crosswave Cordless Max combines chores, vacuuming, and washing at the same time. It's a time. vacuum cleaner. Okay, good. Good luck with that. Sash, Sashi Smith, oops, on the upside down car, true. H.W. Liberty, comment call. Uh, oh, wow, is there any tumbling tumbleweeds out there? I did a, actually did a video yesterday of the tumbling tumbleweeds. I love audio books. I watched 1984 movie recently. Yeah, if you read the, the, the movie's pretty good, I'll admit that. <clears throat> but the, uh, if you read the book, as always, you get a little more flavor. And it was written in 1948. All he did was invert the last two digits of 48 to 84 and call it 1984. But it's a pretty good uh, prediction from 1948 to where we are today, kind of. You know, the, the things that listen to you and all that crap and the, you know, uh, politically correct stuff. Yeah, a lot of that. And anyway, the life and times of Crazy Patrick, that's the person's name on the upside down car. I found out last Thursday, I have the C word, whatever that is, was making all my plans for my class CRV towing my Chevy Spark. It was just like you always say, if there's something you want to do, you better do it now. Now I will most likely be using my RV uh, at in Phoenix. They have a full hookup sites and keep my channel going. Well, good, good for you. Apparently he's got some health issues. Good luck. Uh, life and times of crazy Patrick. Uh, Net P, oops, on the car. Hellcat Granny on home base number four. Familiar scene, Rusty. New Mexico, Texas, Arizona. Thank goodness, goodness it doesn't last forever. Yeah, that's a fact. You know, it, uh, it <laughs> tell the winds blew from 30 to 50 miles an hour for 24 hours. Yeah, I felt like I was on a sailboat the night before. Anyway, uh, or right before last. Thank you, Hellcat Granny. Check her channel out. She's 74-plus years old and drives race cars, uh, Hellcats. 
uh, Sashi Smith, windy. We are experiencing wind here in the Bay Area, California, too, but it looks windier there. Uh, thank you, Sashi Smith. You take care also. C.T. Coburn, your new character, Dusty Zozo, rides in on a gust. Yeah, you could. I mean, you had to be careful. I had to be careful walking outside. I mean, it'd catch a, a gust and knock me off balance. Anyway, James Ortiz uh, on the car. She might be Poco Borracho after drinking a little too much beer. Yeah, Poco Borracho means a little drunk. Borachon is uh, like an alcoholic, a drunkard. Borracho is drunk. Yeah, thank you, James. Uh, it says he's, and he also says in Carrizozo, I'd watch the tumbleweeds and trash blowing down the street, and a week later the wind direction will change, and I'd see the same tumbleweeds and trash blowing the other way. We didn't have much to watch in good old Zozo. <laughs> yeah, that was entertainment, huh? Yeah, but you know, I, I was, I did a video. I, I, I'll post it this morning on on the tumbleweeds. It's, I mean, you know, as usual when you get ready, I saw, I saw some nice looking tumbleweeds blowing. You know, I was parked at uh, Rob Jagger's uh, having a snack the bureau of lands management near uh, capitan new mexico and uh, there was tumbleweeds blowing in the background i thought hell i'll just do a video of that and just as i take the camera out to do the video they there weren't, weren't any more tumbleweeds well, there was a few small ones but i still did it uh brenda mccristy wow that is dusty well it is it sure is was that ain't now uh hope tondelli on uh home base says it says, it says that's not something you want to breathe in your respiratory system. It's particle matter. It stays there. Not good. Well, it's like smoking a cigarette. That, you know, cigarettes, that's all, you know, tobacco, smoke, smoke is a particles. You know, that's why, you know, whenever years ago when they had uh, computers in big rooms with basically clean rooms to keep the heads from crashing on the disc uh, because smoke was a particle, you know, and if you couldn't smoke in that area. Yeah, and dust is the same way. It's just particles. Uh, James uh, James Jackson, life is great, but it ain't bad. Jer yeah, try the other side and see what happens. Jerry D Davis, big bad weather coming your way soon. Been with you here in Texas too, San Antonio to DFW. <clears throat> Y'all you know, keep saying that. But I look here at the 10-day forecast uh, in Carrizozo, and uh, I don't see anything. Uh, nothing. For all the way through uh, October the 22nd. So, you know, a few days after that, I'll be in Texas anyway. So be that as it may, I'll keep up. Charles Lewis, it's a beautiful day. It is. Every one of them is beautiful, Charles, to me. Viola Wilson, it's the great Arizona, New Mexico, Texas land exchange. Yeah, that's it. We're just moving dirt. Thank you, Viola. Alvin Masso, so true on the dust. Yeah, all it glitters isn't gold. Uh, Char we'll do two more here. Charles Lewis, Rusty's Rich, going on a spending spree. Seriously, congratulations. Oh, that was on my new birthday gift to me. That was on the Cloudcroft home, which I lived in a month and sold. And I've taken part of that money and put it in here. So, yeah, we've just swapped dollars. Dale Pointer, The Morning Poetry. Whoops, hold on, let me get it up here. There we go. Uh... What is blowing, we know what it is, fast or slow, warm or cold, everyone knows it's windy. And windy is mighty fine, listen to her cry, wind turbulence in the sky, quickly passing by, it's windy. Thank you, Dale Pointer, for your morning poetry. You have a good day. And last but not least, Scotty Thompson, the mass bowler from Wisconsin, Here's he's just got to get this stuff in here. Says there are a lot of healthier energy drinks. There are no healthy energy drinks, Scotty Thompson. They are all crap, in my opinion. I wouldn't drink them if you paid me. Uh, anyway, they're they're loaded with uh, yeah, yeah. They put a lot of crap on the label, like zinc, vitamin C, B, and all that stuff. They're loaded with caffeine and sugar, which is not good for you because that's the only way they can give you that boost. Anyway, having said that, Scotty, enjoy your life. Drink your drinks if you want to, and enjoy TV and bowling. That's your life. Adios. But anyway, from near Carrizozo, New Mexico, on a cold morning to me, this is Rusty78609 saying, Thumbs up. Carpe diem, which means seize the day in Latin. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. Buy anything you want. 
any time. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you one penny. Just click on the link, go to Amazon, and buy whatever you choose. So if you're going to buy something from Amazon anyway, why not? Anyway, <clears throat> what else? Drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day won't hurt you. It's good for you. It'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones, also help you lose weight. Because you'll be full of water and you will not want to eat so much as in snack. And the only way to lose weight and keep it off, you know it and I know it, is what? Eat less. That's it. I-T. So, what else? Uh, take deep breath. Oh, drink plenty of water. Did I say that? No, I did say that. Take, a, uh, take deep breaths. Breathe in really deep. Hold it for a few seconds and then breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress and relieving stress does what? Lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? You bet. Do it several times a day. Then what else? Stretch. 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 Swivel, swivel, swivel. Walk, walk, walk. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Exercise your body once or twice every single day. Why? Because you'll feel better immediately and you may live longer, healthier because of that one thing. So do it. And then what else? Uh, stand guard at the door of your mind. Do not let negative Nancy or negative Ned get inside of your head. This is your head, your brain, your frontal lobes, your consciousness. All those little neurons in there are forming neural links, which are every single thought you have, every dream, every memory, every single thought. Okay? So, common sense says, add good ingredients. Ta-da! Good life. Now you're on a roll. Don't watch the news. Don't watch the news. Do not watch the news. Why? Cause it's the negativity from the whole universe multiplied times 1,000 and delivered to you by talking heads that must get the ratings up or they're fired. <clears throat> and uh, so will they take liberties with the truth? Yes. Will they exaggerate? Yes. You know, will they put on a show for you to entertain you? It's actually called news entertainment now. That's all it is. You know, that's why there's news about everything. That's why we're so screwed up. You know, everybody in the world is going around... Never mind. Be careful watching the news. Best thing to do is read it. it. Takes all the emotion out of it. Okay? Then, if you really want to do it right, do your own research. Nothing wrong with that. And then what else? Accentuate the positive. Eliminate the negative. Enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time. At ease, carry on. Adios. Bye-bye. Hasta luego. Vaya con Dios. Aloha until the noon video, which will be, hopefully, a trike man video. And I may slide in a, a uh, tumbling tumbleweed video uh, just a little short in the interim anyway guys adios enjoy your wednesday bye bye till next time noonish bye bye